and enjoy the hatching. Honestly, dude, I bet we could do it. Watch it, you got a wyvern coming. Oh! All right, we got that one. Now what does it say? Scare Alpha by killing two betas. What's up, guys? It's King Daddy D Mac, and welcome! Welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved! That's right, we're playing here with Prometheus Reborn, having so much fun doing flips. My goodness, how are you guys doing today? Hope you're doing well. Me personally, I'm doing pretty amazing because yes, as you can see behind us, we have this crazy new insane rock golem type bear. Yeah, it's it's a boss. It's a boss from one of the arc maps and it is just unstoppable. And here on AG Reborn, yeah, that's the mod it's from. You're actually able to tame it. It is so incredibly cool. I've always, ever since I first saw this guy, wanted one and uh, yeah, now we have it. But uh, yes, anyway, things are coming together quite nicely this season now that we're over on the new map. Let's see how our passive gen has been doing on all of our creatures. And look at this. We have 10 new golden treats. We were just about out last episode. But yeah, fully, uh, we got a lot. We got a lot. Let's just go run over here and get it. Uh, the timer up. But a boom. Beautiful. Very cool, guys. Very cool. So let's grab a couple of them to take with us. We don't need quite that many. Let's bring three. Yeah, three I think is good enough for me. And something else that I'd like to do with you is make the shiny finder. This is something that early on in the game, before you can go, you know, make the dino scanners and everything like that, uh, you're able to pick out where shiny dinos are. And we'll show you on the map. Pretty cool. So there's me right there. There's the map and I can pick amongst any anything that's out there and just be like, boom, and shows me where it is. So pretty cool. It's going to help us out with a couple of creatures, possibly if there's a shiny variant, a couple of creatures that we do need to get. Um, we got a couple of passive tame creatures last time, such as the Alpha Dodo, the Elite Zom Dodo, and the Elite Dodo. And those ones, yeah, they're what made all the other passive things for us, such as our Ancient Hide, Ancient Chitin, and Alpha Blood. That's from Alpha Dodo, that's from the Zom Dodo, that's from the, the Elite Dodo. So pretty cool. And then we also have our Obsidian Jug Bugs, and then our Golden Dodo makes us the Health Potions, and the golden treats for instantly taming just about anything in the mod. So very, very cool. So we need to look for that. And then I'd also like to see if we could maybe find a breeding partner for any of these guys. Um, doesn't really matter the level because we already got good levels. We just need, in most cases, a male. Let me just see. We have female, 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 and we do have a male here. And this guy has no gender, so we can't breed. So let's go look for that. And we also got to see if we can find some of the other passive gen creatures, which again, level does not matter. So I'm going to go out on the hunt. I'm going to go search through that long list of possible creatures. And um, yeah, then we'll go meet up the froggy man. He should be here shortly. But anyway, guys, oh, please remember if you're enjoying the series to show that amazing support by slamming that thumbs up button. And if you're new to the channel, you haven't yet. Seriously, what are you waiting for? It is the perfect, perfect time to subscribe. Also, don't forget, we do have a discord. If you want to chit chat, be part of the Mac Pack community. And if you want to do one even better, remember, we now have YouTube memberships, which give you special emotes, give you a special little crown next to your name and chat, and uh, also whitelists you on the PC member server. Yes, which will have all the same mods and everything as we have here, and I'll even hop in and join you. But uh, anyway, guys, uh, wish me luck. Um, let me start going through the shiny finder and... Let's see what epicness we can find for today. Holy crap, guys. This is such, such a bad area, but we have to go this way because right up ahead, oh, there's something that we absolutely need. Oh, come on, bro. Come on. Yes. Look at this. Look at this. We've got 
a shiny Easter Bunny and a Bloodstalker too. Let's get him. Get wrecked. All right. Um. Oh crap. There's some badness. Get. Oh man. Get out of here. Bad things. All right. There's the Easter Bunny. Oh lordy. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh. What? Oh, put food in last slot. I'm such an idiot. All right. Come here. Oh, give me. Yes. We got it. We needed that. All right. Come here, bro. Quickly. Quickly. Pick him up and get the crap out of here. Holy cow. Oh, that is awesome. That was like the last big thing that we needed. Let's get right back to the base. All right, we are back and look at this beautiful Easter Bunny. It is so awesome. Um, Let's go ahead. Takes Percoptodon Settle. Awesome. And this guy is going to make the, what is it? The fur and the polymer, I believe. Yes, these two things in the ancient form if we throw them in here. Now, you could just put them on Wander and he'd make it in his inventory. But if you put them in here, it will go on forever forever otherwise it caps out at uh 500 so we'll leave that in there with all the rest of them it's not going to be a guy that we really uh do much with so you know at least for battling it's just for making resources next up let's go on over i already have a teleporter set out there is a shiny and let's see if we can find him it's in a bad like really bad spot Let's see here. Is this him? We've got RG. Nope, nope. All right. Already gave it away. There should be a shiny RG around here. Let's see if we can find him. Let's see if we can lay our eyes on him. Is this it? Yeah, look at that. It's a super high level, so it's probably going to roll over. Still haven't fixed the shiny dino levels yet, but hopefully we can get a passive tame here. So let's go ahead and get you packed up. All right, beautiful. Let's put on our alpha hat, which again, supposedly it makes us invisible. I still am not positive about this, but you know, there's only one way to find out. And we have to wait for this guy to land. Now there's loads and loads of uh, griffins and all sorts of badness around here, like real bad stuff. It's, it's a mess. But this is the guy we want. And now, doing this the correct way with this helmet, it shouldn't see us. All right, come here, bro. That would be so perfect. Just come down right there. Please, bro. Oh. Oh. Yes! Look at that. That easy. Yes, we did it. We did it. We did it. Oh, my goodness. Can I get my thing? Come here, bro. Where are you? Oh. All right, go, 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 go. All right, let's get back to the base. This one is a male, though. That's the important part. So it's going to allow us to breed. Oh, and finally get backups. I've been so scared to death of losing my RG. Like, you have no idea. But now, we don't got to worry. We don't got to worry at all. So, let me get everything all set up for it. And let's, uh, let's start this breeding. So, there's Red Robin. All right, Red Robin. I guess we can do it over here. And our new one. Hopefully it will reach. Beautiful. What an awesome looking one, too. All right. Passive unfollow. Behavior enable mating. And where is it? Where is it? And behavior enable mating. Awesome. All right. Let's get a whole crap ton of eggs laid. All right, I let them go AFK breeding for a while, and it's probably going to take a couple of breeding sessions before we get it, but the shiny one we got, yeah, every stat rolled over, every single one, I believe, so we want to get, maybe, maybe the food didn't, but we want to get all of these stats pushed over to this one in the baby, so it's going to take a while, um, passing that many stats, but... Who knows? You can always get lucky. Check out all the eggs that we have. Let's go ahead. And I have this set up to auto pick up with uh, soul balls in them. So let's start to hatch them out. Oh, man, it's going to be so many and we'll just destroy any that don't make it. But I'll probably have to do like two or three rounds of this many eggs. Dude, 
It is so beautiful. Look at all the babies. They all got picked up. And when they get picked up, by the way, they get all their imprinting and everything. But look at that. Beautiful. So I'm going to go. It's not bad. I'm going to go through all the stats and uh, I'll do another round if we didn't get it. Wow. We actually did pretty good, guys. I got one perfect one, which one of the stats, the food, the male did have better. So we got one out of all these ones we did. Nearly 60 eggs. Um, the rest of them, all these ones are just one stat off. So at this point, it's probably going to be color that I'm looking to do. And of course, I want to make it look like an alpha. But that one's pretty good, too. Just the speed and speed doesn't matter. Um, let's toss this one out and just have a look-see at it. Oh, look at that guy. Super purdy. And then do we have any with red? So that was a male. We got to find a female with red. That's kind of cool looking. All right. That one has red. And that one doesn't. So I might breed with the original because this one is a male. Let's go grab our original one because I'd like to pass these colors. I want it to look like an alpha still. All right. Awesome. And let's go ahead and get these two breeding. And behavior. Enable mating. And it probably shouldn't take too long. So we're only passing. What was it? One stat. And enable mating. So it shouldn't take that long at all. Then all the rest of these can all be destroyed. Bada boom, beautiful. And then these are other backups that I'll just hold on to just in case. That, you know, are pretty decent. Froggy Man might want them. So I'll see you back in the next session. All right, we are done and let's hatch it out. This one, we're passing one stat and we're trying to get that nice alpha color if possible. And I might have AFK'd too long, but that's okay. Better chance of us to get it. Boom. And enjoy the hatching. Oh, yeah. Lots of awesome colors. I'm really digging that yellow and red. Beautiful. All right. Now it is time to go through the stats and. Oh, man. Already mutation. Tons of good ones. All right. We'll be right back. All right, all these have the perfect stats. Yeah, and some of them even have mutations. So very, very epic. But let's go ahead. I picked out color-wise what I want to choose from. Um, We're going to have a male and a female. So I already picked the female. There's only one. But let's see for the male which one we want. Oh, very nice. Oh, look at that. Oh, that is so cool. All right, so these are our choices. I do have to say, I do like the darker colors with it, but uh, where is the one? Yeah, this one with the greens, pretty. Oh, and it's got the darker colors too. Oh, that is awesome. Yeah, I really like that. And then, well, the female, that one. Okay, yep, This, these two right here at the end. Those are the ones we're choosing. Oh, I love it. And of course we have them all, but those are going to be the ones I spend the time leveling up. So let's get those guys all packed up. All right, sweet. We can toss these ones back into here. All right, cool. And then um, what does it cost for me to upgrade the saddle again? I'm just curious if I have enough. Um, Where the crap is it? I don't see it. Oh, no. Oh, no, it's right there. It's the first one. All right, do we have enough for that? No. What are we short? Let's a see. Let's a see. Hopefully. Oh, it's just fiber, and then we can upgrade it. <gasps> oh, baby. All right. Um, right. Let's get a little bit of fiber. Let's see. Tools. That guy. You know, there's really not too many berry bushes over here. Oh, but this is so phenomenal. I'm so happy we did this. And then I can share with Froggy, too, so he can get a better one. And he should be on shortly. He said he was having a little, uh, some stuff going on at the Froggy home right now. But he said he'll join up with me shortly. So I might spend that time getting our new RGs leveled up to, you know, the same as what the old ones are. It takes a little bit of time. All right, a little bit more fiber. And, you know, I can scout around so we can figure out what we want to do. 
All right, is that all? Nope, a little bit more. Let's go, bro. Really need to get a better fiber getter. It's too bad the bear doesn't get fiber. You know how, like, normally dire bears will get? Pretty sure they get fiber, right? All right, and beautiful. Fairy would definitely be cool. So we'll have to see. But anyway, let's just see if we can craft up these saddles. Um, Let's go ahead and grind this one down to a new one. All right, cool. And then I should make another AG workbench, huh? AG! So we can put it right next to it. All right, awesome. Boom. And let's get in that. Let's throw in that stuff. And let's go ahead and see. I might be able to upgrade it a couple more times. That would actually be pretty helpful too. Dude. All right, how much more? Let's see if I have enough to do another craft. I do, I do. So that means we can grind it down. Thank goodness, because we got all that epicness last time. All right, if we get lucky, this will be the maxed out level, which I think is going to be the 755. But I don't know, it could go higher than that. Oh no, that is the max level. All right, let's see if we can make two of them. Epic. All right, for our two new guys, got to love it. Um, Yeah, I left all them over there. Let's get all these ones packed up. Beautiful. All right, I'll throw the, the parent. We can probably destroy the first parent. So that's the imprinted one. And then these are two originals. I'll toss those back in here. Bada bing, bada boom. Awesome. Yeah, that's everything. All right. And I can make one a speed one and one more of an attacking based one. But either way, we have max saddles for them both. So that is quite cool. I don't know. What should we go on? Um, the female actually has a mutation boost. So it's a little tiny bit uh, better health. So we'll just have to see. But anyway, in fact, they both have a boost. I think this one is the boost in... Let's see. Health is 138. Yeah. So the female is the boost in health. The male has a boost in... I think it's like food. Yeah, food. It doesn't really matter. But anyway... Very, very cool. Let's get them leveled up. Ooh, and before I pump levels into it, guys, check it out. It is hitting for 14,653 because of the imprint. It is so much stronger. Remember the other one? It started off at like 8,000. That is nutty. Absolutely insane. This is going to be so much stronger, guys. All right, I am doing amazing. Absolutely spectacular. Um, The first one, the male, I am basically done. One, two, three, four, five. Max attack, I did 24 into movement speed and 25 into health. So pretty well rounded, but much faster. And let's see, what is this guy going to hit for? So our other one, I'm not quite max attack on it yet, but uh, the apparent was hitting for like around 40,000. 78,000! That is incredible. And then if we hook Froggy Man up with one um, that gives us mate boost, dude, we're going to be through the roof. This is so, so good. Of course, Stegos resist, but I am loving it. I already started doing a little bit on the... Uh, ooh, look at the unicorn. Dude, I wonder what unicorns do. I don't know. Um, I already started doing a little bit of leveling on the female, but this one is maxed out. So, right? You're maxed out? Hold on. Just confirm. Yep, maxed out. All right. Um, is Dumpling... Dude, we haven't put anything. We can go even higher, too. A couple extra levels once we get our uh, chibi worked up as well but froggy man said he's logging in right now so i wanted to gift him an alpha pteranodon too so that uh you know we can have what i say pteranodon an alpha rg2 so that we can have the rg squad and maybe between the two of us we can start to take on some of the larger eye uh, creatures that unlock more progress but oh, this this is just nuts 
So the female, I'm going to do all melee, all health. That's it. No extra movement speed. So it will be our more battle-hardened mount. But I am loving it. And this map is so good. But anyway, I'm going to start heading back to the base. Froggy man, what's up, buddy, bro? How you doing today? Oh, amazing as always. Dude, what are you riding on? Dude, it's, it was in my, it was right in front of my base. I like walked out, do my intro, and I walked out the door, and bam, it was right there. Oh, it's a holographic Ovis. These things are so cool, dude. I know it's a level two thousand three hundred twenty-six. <laughs> we we gotta fix that shiny bad. thing, man. We gotta get that on that pronto. Yeah, I'm sure there's not very good stats on this thing, but yeah. it is cool. Well, it's an Ovis, so who cares? But hey, dude. Yeah. Um, I, I'm going to put it inside your Ovis. I, oh, uh, did a little bit of breeding this morning. Oh, oh, look at these. Yeah. Hold on. Let me put this guy away. All right. Let's take a look at these guys. Now you got to throw them out. So they imprint to you. All right. But they are monsters. And I made oh. sure they were both green too. Oh, they are green. Yeah. Oh, wow. Look at those. They are gorgeous, but I thought, bro, we could go out real quick and see if we could take on something with it. Oh, I'm all for it. Let me see which one do I want to take. I want to take... You're going to... Oh, no, no, no. You come back here. <laughs> uh, I'm going to take, take the boy one. You're going to take the boy one? All right. I'll yeah. go out on the girl one then. Perfect. Okay. I got a saddle too, man. Oh, go perfect. Out. A little tracker in there just to make sure. Very nice. I think the only thing I'm missing is the XP potion. Oh, um, yeah, let me, th let me throw a couple in for you. Oh man, you're the man. Oh, I'm going to do two things. I'm going to do you one better. I'm going to throw in the infinity speed. You got to make yourselves one of those. And oh. then I will throw in, let me see. Bada bing, bada boom. Nice. All right. I'm to, so I, was, I didn't even know what the infinity speed does. The infinity speed, it, it gives it a boost in movement speed, but it also lets it fly backwards now. Oh. Yeah. Ooh, I like that. Isn't that good? And it's like you not fly, a huge you fly boost. Faster backwards. <laughs> it's not a huge boost, but it's enough that if you didn't want to, you know, spend into uh, into movement speed, you could get away with it. Oh, dude, this thing's amazing. Right? I mean, I would put a couple in movement speed. Yeah, you can do whatever you want, dude. Whatever you want. But hey, do you want to go run over here? I haven't seen uh, this area yet. Oh yeah, this is the um, we call it the uh, um, 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 uh, the extinction. The extinction. Yeah. Oh. Ooh. Oh. Uh, honestly, dude, I bet we could do it. You think so? These aren't like this guy. I mean, we might want to get a few levels in. We'll see. Watch it, you got a wyvern coming. Oh! Go away, wyvern! Dude, I'm gonna get him. Come here, wyvern! Like, look at us, dude. We are beasts. Absolute my, uh... beasts. Done. We are. We are beasts, man. That's crazy. You know what? Well, you want some too, wyvern? All right, let's finish off this Giga before he regens all of his health. Oh, I know, man. He's already regening it. Oh, look at your guy. Your guy is strong. Yeah, I've been leveling up for a little bit. But trust me, dude. This thing gets so strong. Oh, I can't wait, man. Oh, little Rex over here. Rex the face. Dude, this is going to get us max level super quick, too. Dude, I hope so. Oh, come here, Rex. Yeah, I only have 100 points into my melee. It gets a lot stronger. Damn. Oh, dude, I got you. Wow. Wow. That's a lot of levels, man. Oh! All right, I'm going all the way for uh, for me to max attack. Oh, oh look at that. Dude, with me boost. That's Whoa. yours is the exact same. Yours is gonna do if you get 255 in there. Holy That's cow! Amazing. That's amazing. Right? Wow. Oh, you gotta finish putting in your uh, your melee, dude. Let's make sure you get the rest. All right, I'm gonna do that right now. 
Because if we can get this good enough to take on a Savage, I think they're called, uh, it unlocks uh, the, the Chitin armor or the Flak armor. Yeah, that's good enough. All right, let's go. So we're going to kill Savage. Yeah, well, I don't know if we can, but that is like what we need to work towards. And what does the Savage do? They're like, uh, they're just like boss guys. I think in like Extinction Core, they were called, uh, that's what they called the Prime Alphas, maybe. Gotcha. Yeah, I remember those. But I remember those. That's what unlocks the next stage of armor. That's what I really want. It's, oh, yeah, we need the better armor. Yeah. So, um, do you want to go on the hunt? See if we can find yeah. one? I say, let's do that. All right, I'll meet you back when we find something. Ooh, did you find something, Froggy? I did, right down here. Oh! You got to be careful, though. There's, like, Rexes and Raptors. Oh, God. Um, so I, found, I found a Savage uh, Raptor. Oh! All right, this one, I think it unlocks the uh, the camouflage armor, the ghillie armor. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah, 2.3 million. I think we can handle this, maybe. I think our sea attack is strongest, too, isn't it? Um, that only works if you're landed. Oh, we got this, dude. We totally got this. He's not even barely biting. Holy, dude. We're invincible, dude. Dude, we're kicking his butt. Holy cow. Damn, yeah, dude. And we got the replicator, too. Oh. Yeah, dude. All right. I don't know. Did you, uh, I mean, did, hurt. did you get anything from it? Uh, I didn't get anything in my inventory. Let me see. Um, oh, I got, oh, I got low experience potion. Oh, nice. Yeah, when I harvest, I didn't get the kill, but when I harvested them, I got ancient hide and blood. Not that much. Oh, yeah, yeah, I just got three low uh, experience potions. That was it. But dude, we unlocked the armor. Dude, that's the good stuff too, man. Yeah, that's my favorite. It got. Let me that's see. That's literally one of my favorite. Oh, this isn't too bad to craft either. No, it's not bad at all. Oh, okay. So this stuff, it's basically like the elf hat. Um, it did do half of my guy's health though. It did? Yeah. I didn't even realize yeah. it. Yeah, he hurt me, dude. Whoa, he, dude. They have Dinopithecus on this map. Dinopithecus. Oh. Yeah. Where's I can pick him up too. Wait, you got Dinopithecus? Yeah, there's another one. Pick it up. It's there Where in the ground. There? Oh, See it? How do I pick him up? How do I pick right him click up? Uh, with the with the RG. You know, like pick up. Oh, right yeah, click. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey, hey, hey! All right, we made it back, Froggy. Hey, you got that? It's not tamed. I I gotta drop him to tame him. I've been afraid oh, to. No. Can we I, drop I, him I, right I, now? No, he <laughs> kill me. All right, Froggy. Well, hey, am I gonna see you next time? Yeah, I will see you next time. All right. Later, Froggy, and take care of those RGs. I will. Thank you, D-Mac. I think it's amazing. Best present ever. You're welcome, buddy, bro. Let me get in here before you drop that thing, because I don't want to get destroyed. <laughs> All right. Talk to you later. All right. Later, Froggy. Oh, man. It's always so good to see Froggy Man hang out with him. I'm glad that we could hook him up. It's it's important, though, that we get that mate boost. Like, super important. It's insane how much higher the levels go. But uh, Dinopithecus, I uh, don't know if it's going to work with the Golden Tree, but we can try. Um, I also don't know if he's going to see us when we do the passive. Now, I know normally that this is... What I'm about to do is not how you tame one. So I'm hoping that this is like a modded variant. Let's get all those guys picked up. All good? All right, let's get these guys put away. All right. Beautiful. And I'm going to quickly craft up a set of the new ghillie armor. And we can try that because it's unbreakable. All right. Let's get this armor crafted up. So it is called camo armor. Beautiful. And it takes two sets of vanilla ghillie to make it. Kind of crazy. It's going to cost a lot to upgrade this, but for now, this should be fine. It is unbreakable and again, should give the same effects as wearing the alpha hat. All right. Beautiful. Let's go ahead and grab a treat. 
All right, hopefully this works. If it doesn't, we're going to have to go and get other stuff, but... All right. And this should make it so stuff doesn't see us. We'll find out. I hope this thing didn't despawn being a shiny. Oh, I see him way over there in the corner. All right. So it says passive tame. I don't know if I have to crouch when we're in this. No clue. All right, all right. Here we go, here we go. Come on, buddy. Oh, it doesn't like it. What does it say? There has to be more than one. Crap. All right, we got a couple more of them just right over here, real close by the base. Let's go ahead. Come here. Can I pick you up? Oh, it's so annoying. Come here. I don't know how I was able to before. Froggy was having problems picking them up too. All right, got him, got him. Yeah, you have to do it just right. All right, we got that one. Now what does it say? It says alpha, scare alpha by killing two betas. All right. All right. Dude, I just, didn't I just kill two betas? Are you kidding me? Oh, kill one. Okay. Okay. I don't know where this one came from. This is like a third one. All right, got him. Health must be below 85%. This armor is awesome. Golden tree, got him! That's pretty cool. I'm sure it's much harder if you don't have epic armor like we do, but we just got a baller, baller, shiny Dino Pithecus. Look at the colors too. <laughs> He's sick. Oh my Lord. All right. I don't know if this guy is considered a modded variant, like different, but it might be. It actually might be. Yeah. Pretty cool, guys. Pretty cool. Just something fun. It's weird how his, his hair up at the top. Look, when you're in the shadow, it looks red. Oh, you're gorgeous, bro. You are absolutely stunning. But anyway, I think we did pretty good today, guys. We got a Dinopithecus. We got the most amazing RGs. Yup. And hooked him up, Froggy. We killed our very first Savage and... Yeah, we now have the camouflage armor, which is unbreakable. It is just stupendous. But anyway, guys, on that note, let me go through those comments. All right, guys, I just finished going through the comments. And yes, it is now that time. That's right. Time to name the dinos! For those of you that do not know, at the end of every single episode, I go through the comments of the previous episode, and I pick out all the most awesomest name suggestions that you guys leave in the down there. That's right. Just remember, if you want to have a chance of getting your name chosen, you got to be a subscriber. So smash that subscribe button and yeah, just comment down below. It is just that easy. Anyway, for today, we got a whole bunch to name. We've got all of our dodos. So let's do that first. And I want to remind you guys. We already have a Don the Dodo. It was the very first Dodo that we tamed. But that being said, uh, I'll show you the variations that would have been Don, but I changed it up a little bit. You'll see. We have for our new golden one, though, Gold Rush. Love it. We have Donna, the Alpha Dodo, because it's female. We have Zon, the Zombo. Very cool for the zombie one. And we have Donnie, the Elite Dodo. It's like the Teenage Dodo. Yeah, there we go. So all of our dodo names. Then for the bear, we have the one, the only Rocky Bear Boa. Perfect name, guys. I totally love it. For next time, we need a name for, we're just going to skip, don't name the shiny one that we tamed today. It's just going to be the two that we leveled up, that we bred, the babies, the male and the female. So we need name for our two new alphas for our rainbow dinopithecus. 
So very cool. And of course, for our Easter Bunny. So help me out, guys, in the comments below. Um, also, check it out. I upgraded it all the way. I had to make so many ghillie suits, but totally, totally worth it. Our best armor yet. And it makes us invisible to dinos. So very cool. Oh, and I almost forgot. This guy gets a special saddle. Check it out. We have an unbreakable, um, the hide one that I was wearing. Well, there you go. Oh, you look so much better, bro. So much better. I love it. Anyway, guys, yes, thank you oh so much for watching. It's been a pleasure, as you always do. Please remember to show that amazing support for the series by smashing that thumbs up button. If you're new to the channel and you haven't yet, please do not forget to subscribe for the Daily Arc awesomeness. Be sure to check out the Discord if you need any help with anything, just want to chat, whatever. I'm in there. Yeah, be part of the Mac Pack. And finally, again, we do have YouTube memberships now. You do get whitelisted. That means you get to be on the sub server, or in this case, the member server. If you do join, plus you get cool little badge next to your name whenever you comment and special emotes. So thanks to all you members out there. Anyway, guys, see you tomorrow. Thanks again. And as always, peace out.